You know, there's just some foods that go together naturally, like they're made for each other. Chips and dip, bacon and eggs, bread and butter, pizza, and worms. Hmm, yes, Pizza Worm. This is a freeware game from 1994 developed by Sammy Lettinen from Finland and released under the name Zorlim Software. It was actually his only completed game as he'd previously worked on a clone of Rhett Anderson's arcade volleyball succinctly titled Zorlim's Arcade Volleyball, but that never actually left the beta stage of production. Pizza Worm, however, left all kinds of stages of production, and was actually updated as recently as 2007. Not sure if it's official or not, but there is definitely a version from then that is a little more improved. It's pretty much a Snake clone, before Snake was even a thing, so uh, I guess more accurately you could call it a Nibbles clone, and by that I mean you're a snake, or rather a green worm in this case, that goes around eating things and getting longer with each thing eaten. If you run into something that isn't food, you scream and it's game over, in quite the spectacularly bloody fashion. <laughs> or maybe it's pizza sauce, but you know, that's boring. I always liked thinking of it as blood and gore, because I was a teenager when I played this. Yes, this was one of those games I played endlessly in high school, before the age of any kind of decent cell phones that could keep you occupied during class. Or more specifically, study hall. Hmm, when I think of study hall games, this one exemplifies that perfectly. You see, back then, there was a computer class I took where the teacher actually put me in charge of building and setting up and installing all the DOS and Windows 95 computers around the school. And me being a DOS gamer with tons of responsibility, I always carried around a few floppies in my book bag filled with random shareware and freeware titles to quote-unquote test my freshly built DOS machines. And you know, because I was a cool guy, I hid the games in a subfolder on the C drive and let my friends know where to find find them. That way, whenever someone had a study hall or just wanted to screw around while the teacher was facing the other way, they could play a game instead of having to do something dumb like schoolwork or paying attention. Yeah, I was a great influence like that. Anything to help out my fellow classmates. Anyway, Pizza Worm was one of those games that I always installed on those machines, and there's a good reason for that. It's freaking Pizza freaking Worm. You're a worm that eats pizza and explodes in a gory mess when he dies. What else do you need? You don't need. But even still, ah, there's more. I mean, he even has things to say when he partakes of a pie, which is really a step beyond for a Nibbles clone. Yum. I still say yum like that sometimes. That's the kind of effect this game had on me. It also made me appreciate turning in circles, because you can turn in circles in this game, and that's kind of amazing. Like, how many other games like this can you just change directions in any which way and not have to rely on 90 degree angles? I wasn't aware of any back then, that's for sure, and as such, it changed my life. It really does give the game a unique spin, so to speak, and there's something bizarrely addictive about making all these swirly patterns on your goal for total pizza domination. And if you wanted to, you could even play against a friend, which meant you could play against a friend, and that is quite friendly. But I never did that because my friends wanted to play it all alone because they hogged the computers that I so graciously built and installed games on them. That's, uh, that's high school for you. But, you know, whatever, Pizza Worm is lovely. I like this game because, man, I just do. I, I can't tell you why. Maybe maybe it's the silly Zorlum's Pizzeria in the background. I always wondered what the heck is on those menus. Things for worms to eat? You know, like dirt? Maybe apples? Oh no, I, I guess not. Apparently. Pizza. Worms like pizza. Who knew? I know. I know now. I've always known because of Pizza Worm. Thank you, Zorlum Software, for making everything better with Pizza Worm. Want more worms in your videos? Or references to things in high school that don't matter? Well, there's more videos here that probably don't have either one of those, but you can still watch them, or you can just subscribe. And as always, thanks for watching.